robbed, jailed, and often fear for their lives. Two Nepalese cyclists have been traveling the world for the past 11 years in the name of world peace. Now they have stopped in Macau where they share their story with TDM. These two Nepalese cyclists have arrived to Macau five days ago and plan to stay for another week. It has been 11 years since the maths and sociology teachers left Nepal for a round-the-world trip. They have been to 115 countries across four continents, and all in name of world peace. Yeah, this is our small practice uh, to promote the message of peace and brotherhood in the world. And mainly, uh, 12, uh, almost 12 years back, many countries of the world like East Timur, Bali of Indonesia, South part of Thailand, Myanmar, Sri Lanka, Pakistan, Afghanistan, Iraq, Somalia, Ethiopia, Sudan, Chad, Rwanda, Burundi, Sierra Leone, Liberia, Haiti, Congo, Pakistan, Israel, Lebanon, who is suffering from violence, conflict, war, and antagonism. Uh, even Nepal also was suffering and realizing uh, the necessity of promoting the message of peace and brotherhood, we made decision to do this. The over a decade long trip has not been short in adventure, with obstacles such as poor weather or lack of proper conditions to cycling being frequent. But the two men have also faced much more serious shortcomings. Many things were robbed. We were nearly killed in uh, Bangkok of Thailand also, and our more than uh, seven eight digital cameras uh, more than 10 uh, mobile phones and uh, rings and some money were stolen stolen in different uh, places at that time our bicycle had sudanese government flag which was recognized worldwide and when we completed the tour of uh, north sudan and went to south sudan with the same flag and the people of south sudan uh, suspected on us and they called the police and arrested us they thought that we had been sent by the north government as a spy the Nepalese were eventually released and went on to travel to other countries where they saw little of everything. Uh, everywhere we can see good people also, bad people also, rich also, uh, poor also, happy and unhappy also. But uh, on the comparison, uh, the life of African people are very, uh, very pitiable. And we can see uh, many people <laughs> Uh, many hungry people, naked people, and uh, suffer from different kinds of disease in Africa. And, but the people of uh, Europe and Sanzen countries are very happy. With the financial support of the Nepalese government and the help of many of the locals they've met in different countries, the two professors are now about to head to another adventure. Next stop, Japan, and afterwards, Eastern Europe. The goal is to visit 38 countries during the next two years and a half.